Hello, welcome to the video tutorial of Marketplace Seller Coupons for Magento 2. Now this is an add-on for Webcool Magento 2 Marketplace. By the help of this add-on, the seller can create coupons and the customer can avail those coupons to have the discount. So coming to the installation of this module, once you have downloaded the module from a store, you will be getting it in a zip format. So unzip it and then you have to click on the module folder after clicking on the module folder you will be getting the src folder just click on the src folder you will be getting the app folder just upload the app folder into your magento 2 root directory and then you're done with the installation part now let's come to the seller part and see how the seller can create the coupon codes now this is my seller panel so on the menu you will be seeing seller coupon manager so just click on this menu And then you will be seeing the seller coupon page so you can see the existing coupon coupon code the coupon value status use description like these three are not used but this one is used so when it was used and the order number when it was created when it will expire and when it was used you can just delete as well so i will just click this three after selecting these three i can just delete these coupons Now you can see coupons deleted successfully so now i will create a new coupon so let's enter anything in the code prefix video test 456 the value of this particular coupon suppose 100 how many quantity so i will select two and the expiration date and then i will click here to generate the coupon So now it is getting generated so now you can see two coupon code as we have selected as we have entered two quantity so two quantity of coupon value 100 created at this time expire at that time is created so now let's move to the customer panel and see how he can use this particular coupon code now this is my product page so just this is the quantity I have entered and now I will click here to add this particular product into the cart. Now this is my cart page. So you can see the product, the seller, you can see the price, the quantity and the subtotal. So you can see the subtotal, the coupon discount now is zero because we haven't applied any coupon and the tax is zero. So the total order is $468. So from here you will get seller discount codes. So from here you have to select the shop. So I will select the shop and then you have to just enter your coupon code. So this is the coupon code which I just created a few minutes back and then I will click here to apply the coupon. Now you can see that the coupon has been applied successfully. So the coupon value was 100. So the coupon discount is 100. So now the total order is 368. And you can see the co applied coupon shop and the coupon code. So now we will just proceed to the checkout and do the order placement. Now on the payment and review page, you can see the payment method I have selected and you can see the order summary. The sub car total is $468 coupon discount is $100 shipping is $10 so the total order is $378 you can see the product name image quantity and you can see your shipping address your shipping method and this is your address billing and shipping address so now I will click here to place the order now this is my seller part again so just go to my order history and click on the order and then you will be seeing this detail so now this is in pending state you can see the order details and then you can see the subtotal which is 468 shipping and handling and then the discount shipping and handling is not displaying because the customer has selected default magento shipping method 
so the shipping and handling part is not displayed to the seller but it will be displayed to the customer when the customer will view the order from his end and the, the customer sorry the seller can also see the discount part over here so the total ordered amount is this much and the vendor amount is this much and the admin commission is this much so now we will generate the invoice and then we will see the discount part on the invoice as well now this is the invoice so you can see the details like billing address shipping address payment information shipping information and then here also you can see the discount part and that is hundred dollar has been discounted now let's move to the admin part now this is my admin panel so just go to marketplace management and then select coupons so just click on here and then you can see seller coupons manager page is opening now here you can see the various coupon used so from you can select the checkbox and then you can delete from here you can see the seller name order id description price created expiration date used status and credit deduction status so this was mine louis davis the order id was 69 this is the order number this much has been the coupon value when it was created expiration date and the status is used the admin can also see the coupon details on the seller order page like for this particular seller i can see his all order till now he has to order purchase date product name quantity to be paid sub total total tax total shipping and this is the coupon amount so this one also the admin can see so this is all about this particular module if you have any doubt regarding this module you can just raise a support ticket at webcool.com thank you